Greetings all. Crytek have just released their new trailer for the next event called Devil's Moon. This will be our third moon event after Traitor's Moon and Serpent Moon. So let's take a look at the trailer and I'll give my thoughts. So a classic teaser from Crytek, not giving too much away, but there are some things that I noticed. Among our legendary hunters is the Devil's Advocate, who was our legendary unlock from last year's Christmas event, as well as the skin flip. So I think it's safe to say that we will hear more about the event in the next couple of weeks, as this seems to be our next Christmas event. I'm going to also assume we will be able to purchase him. So if you didn't get a chance to get him last year, now may be your chance. And if we follow our trend of previous events, there will probably be a chance to unlock previous winter event skins. When releasing the teaser, Crytek also wrote, It will end soon. All of this. We figured it out. Figured out how to kill him. Who could this be referring to? Possibly Mr. Cherry, as the law would indicate he is up to no good. From this we can now assume that the moon events are a trilogy, and that this will be the last one before we move on to more chapters in 2023. In our previous event, we saw hunters stuck in King Snake 9, but now we are in still water and they are all running towards the same place, where this spiky form appears. A lot of speculation has been going on already that this is the new boss, but I don't think that is the case. I believe that this is some sort of totem or entity that you have to maybe destroy or activate for event points, but I guess we'll have to wait and find out in the upcoming weeks. If you look closely in the background behind our hunters, there seems to be a yellow haze. Could this possibly mean a new time of day, like when we had Serpent Moon? It looks very similar to the air or surrounding of Forest Five, so could we be in for some more treacherous terrain to cross? This is all I've picked up on. Please feel free to comment your thoughts in the comments, and I will see you all soon in the next video. Ah!